consider the graph of the function y is equal to x cube it's a classical example of a function which has a lot of important properties which can be studied so the graph of the function y is equal to x cube is shown in white and there are some tangent lines drawn to the graph of this function at various points there are those yellow colored graph uh, which are corresponding to tangents to the left of the y axis to the function and as you can see the tangent lines have changing slopes so for example this graph here this tangent has some particular slope and then the second one which i am showing has a lesser slope and as you go more towards increasingly positive values of x you get the third tangent which is slightly less steeper what we observe from these three tangents is that their slopes are increasing the slope of one if I call that M1 is greater than the slope of the second tangent and the slope of the third tangent is even less than that of M2. Something else is happening on the right side of the y axis. So if we have this corresponding to the point say 4, this corresponding to 5 and this corresponding to 6 then m4 is less than m5 is less than m6 so what we are observing is that to the right side of the y-axis that is for positive values of x the tangent lines have increasing slopes and to the left of the y-axis the tangent lines have decreasing slopes as we go move from west to east that is increasing values of x so what does this signify this signifies that the values of the derivative of the function is gradually decreasing as we move from left to right in the negative part of the graph and in the positive part of the graph the value of the derivative of the function is actually increasing as we go from west to east that is from negative to positive values of x increasing the values of x gradually so f dash x decreases and the slopes of tangent decreases as x increases whereas on the right side of the function f dash x increases and slopes of tangent increases as x increases so just to give a primer on the right side the function is said to be concave up and on the left side of the y-axis the function is said to be concave down let us define this concept a little more exactly so just as the first derivative is related to the slope of tangent lines the second derivative also tells us something regarding the graph of the function the second derivative roughly speaking determines the curvature of the function and its alignment with respect to some direction that we are interested in so therefore we can define concavity as if f is a differentiable function on an open interval and f dash is increasing on this interval i then f is concave up on i if f dash is decreasing on i for increasingly positive values of x then f is concave down on i 